Not that funny, but I'm going to try it anyways. Um, how many of you have done stupid stuff when you were kids? Ooh. Okay, what kind of stupid stuff? Like setting things on fire, blowing things up, hitting your parents? Yeah, no, or that was just me. I don't know. Um, so, I was quite a tomboy when I was little, that little seven year old. And um, overalls, yeah, I was quite, you know, unstylish. And um, not that much changed. Anyways, so when I was little, when I was tomboy, and me and my stepbrothers would go do crazy stuff, like we'd uh, steal kids' bikes and take the wheel off, take the rubber off, and get that little tube that's inside there and <laughs> put propane in it, roll it down the street, and that blow up. That was awesome. What? <laughs> and yeah, we'd put like, <laughs> mud on it and watch it explode. So one time we hit a car and we had to run for it. Yeah, that was fun. And except the fact that we got chased and I got splinters and yeah. Anyways, so this one time we got the bright idea to uh, go up into the attic, get some of my grandpa's clothes, stuff some hay in it, you know, make it look like a person, tie a rope around its neck, tie it to a tree, not like that, sometimes, and we would pull it back and we'd swing it across the road so when it was dark outside they would think a person's darting oh. across the road oh. and it was... Oh. Anyways, so... This one time, it was getting dark, and we were sitting, by the way, on a branch over the tr over the road, just to see, you know, the car swerve and almost crash. Yeah. Never and uh, so we were sitting over it, and I was at the back, <laughs> the tree trunk right here, and then my two brothers in front of me, because I was the smallest. And uh, we swung, I, you know, I, hold, I held it, and there was a car coming. Couldn't see the car, just see the held the headlights, and I let it go. And it actually hit it. It's not supposed to hit it. So there goes my grandpa. And uh, oh my god! Here. <laughs> wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo. Yeah. And then red and blue lights, and that was the end of it. <laughs> Being naive, we didn't think to climb down the tree and run. We just kind of stayed there in shock. And you know, we hear the, the boots of the cop, and he tugs on the rope and the branch breaks and what's under us nothing for about 30 feet and so we all fall on the cop we died <laughs> we used to say yeah, the cop died and uh after we fell the funny thing was that when he was down we ran lots of trouble <laughs>